today we need to get into some sort of shocking but cute moments posted on V and what happened there. We need to get into the Friends music video actress, apparently rumored to have exposed that V has a lover, and I'll get into this and what's going on with that. We also have a V losing 2 million followers on YouTube. So you don't think to save this hater or not, make sure you subscribe with the notification bell on. Make sure you join us fangirling on Patreon and let's go. We need to get into V losing 2 million followers because this is definitely a big story and people are very, very upset about this. So if you're unaware of what is going on, people logged in onto YouTube and saw that one of V's accounts had lost a significant amount of followers. And what was left was a little less than 30,000 followers. Now, if you're wondering, oh, V doesn't really have his own account, what are you talking about? Well, these are the automated channels and the ones that sort of take V's video from all over YouTube and put it together on this channel. Now, this channel is only controlled by YouTube themselves. The artist themselves don't even have control over this channel nor do the label. This is just automated. It happens when there's a lot of content about one specific person or one specific topic and so YouTube's AI or whatever it is will kind of put together all those videos collectively onto a channel. So if you're interested in that topic and you subscribe to that AI generated channel you will get alerts of every single video that references that topic. And it's an easy sort of way to follow along that topic without having to follow every single account that may report on that topic, if that makes sense. So every single one of the BTS members has their own topic AI generated channel and V is no different from that. However, for some reason, it was believed that early this morning or whenever it was, that whole topic channel got completely removed and it was then reinstated with another channel that was a V, but it only had 30,000 followers. Of course, this made people pretty upset because if you're someone that was following along with this topic of V and then suddenly you're unsubscribed, that can be very annoying. It also doesn't help the artist as much because now when a video is posted within that topic channel, it's only going to be exposed to 30,000 people instead of 2 million. Also, and what I think most people are upset about is that when you look at all the other members of BTS, it's topic accounts and they all have millions. So it just looks bad that V would be the only one with 30,000 and then he is going to get made fun of for that. Now I want to go over a couple of reasons why topic channels get removed and reinstated. Happens all the time. Is it frustrating? Sure. Does it actually matter in the grand scheme of the artist's success? Absolutely not. Doesn't even matter a little bit. In the grand scheme of things, I'm going to ask how many people actually check their subscription feed. I think when I post the video, the video personally, I think there's maybe like five to 10% of people that are getting my videos from the subscription feed, if that. It might even be a little lower than that. Most of the time, people who are subscribed to me are getting my videos from the front page. So ultimately, what matters is if YouTube or any social media platform that you're on just decides to show you the content because most people are not watching it from the subscription tab. So if you're interested in V and you're interested in BTS, you'll get recommended that content regardless of whether you're subscribed to him or not. Now, let me explain how the topics channel works. People can literally claim the topic channel and then if they claim and say that everything on the topic channel is in fact their content, it can then get merged into their original channel. And this is how those channels get taken down. Now what could happen is either Hybe or V himself could claim the content on there is him and then it could get merged into either a the official BTS account or the official Hive account. And then there could be a chance that someone wanted to backtrack from there and realize that it didn't want all those videos that were on the topic channel to be on their official channel. So they decided to ultimately just say no. And then the topic channel was then reopened again. So while we are getting mad at YouTube and attacking them for being angry that they took the channel down and reinstated it with way less followers, this could be the fault of the label or the artists themselves having taken action and then deciding to go back on it. Now, this is a theory. Of course, I have no idea what the truth is, but this is what YouTube publicly claims is the only reason they would take down a topic channel. Of course, as I say here many times on the channel, please don't jump to conclusions and start attacking or mass posting things because most of the time there's stuff happening behind the scenes that we don't know of. And when there is, it's a bad thing to protest and be angry because you never know what type of commotion is happening behind the scenes already and how much anxiety everyone is having behind the scenes. And then this just kind of pushes that more. And then what if people get fired and lose their job? Like that's not something that I think most people want to have on their conscience. Of course, not all things that are trending 
and being talked about are bad things. We had moments where V was recently seen on a soldier's Instagram account. Now, I'm not going to share the soldier's Instagram account, nor do I actually even really know what the account is. But I think even if I did know, I wouldn't want to publicly share it and put the soldier in the spotlight if the soldier is not looking to be a public figure. So apparently a soldier posted a dance move that V had taught the soldier and V was in the video as well. And it was just a cute moment in between training that seemed like V and this soldier were just having a cute moment. It really shows how close V has gotten to every single soldier at the camp and how close the soldiers have gotten to him, wanting to be taught the ways of an idol. I mean, I wouldn't even think about that, but one of the things I, of course, would want V to teach me or do if I was at the camp with him would be a dance move. Obviously, people were shocked about this. I think a lot of people were very envious of this because they get these sorts of interactions and new people and befriend new people and really get close to new people. I mean, there's really nothing here that makes or shouldn't make anyone feel like V is being used for clout because I think that the soldier was just posting this video as a fun thing for their friends to see. So I'm really glad it was posted and it makes me really happy to see this. Since V announced his music, video there's been a lot of commotion going on and not necessarily all good things some really bad and negative things first off we know from some of the photos that have come out, it seems like V has a love interest in the music video. We see some photos of this girl and this actress named Ruby Sears is being close with the hugging and it makes it seem like V has a romantic partner in this music video. There's a couple things to note for the sanity of some people in the fandom. Is that Ruby is in a relationship and she doesn't look like she's trying to be with V. The second point that I want to make is that not every girl and not every single beautiful person that ever exists and does get in contact with V wants to date him. There are some people who genuinely their type is not someone, even if that person is really good looking. Second of all, it was believed that people were getting really, really upset to the point where there were some posts saying that they felt really sick and even some posts saying that V, you can do whatever you want, but I just want you to know that I'm really upset. And I'm reading this like, okay, do you think he's thinking about you being upset? Do you think he's losing sleep about this? He doesn't know you. And in fact, he would think you're absolutely crazy for dictating how he should live his life and doing what he wants to do. V and all of the BTS members have talked at length about wanting to have kids and a family. Don't you think at one point they would be in a relationship? People think that Ruby was essentially leaking that he was in a relationship by basically being chummy and cute with him in these concept photos. And I'm not going to sit here and say that he's not in a relationship because I actually have no idea whether he is or isn't. And I think he could be in one. I don't think that's a terrible thing. I think that that's a natural progression for him. He's going to be 30 soon and maybe not like soon soon, but he will eventually be 30. And that means he is going to be thinking about things like settling down, being in a relationship, if he's not personally thought of these things, his family will be pushing him to be in a relationship and to settle down. Him having a family, settling down, having kids, these are not foreign things. And if you can't support what he does and in fact is very upset that he could potentially be very happy and you're losing sleep or are unable to eat or having any physical symptoms of this, please get psychological help. And I don't mean get psychological help just for this reason. I mean, these types of people are not stable enough to be living in the world. These are the type of people that would get triggered so easily by something because they're so into this type of thing that they cannot fathom what the reality of the world is and thus are actually a danger to society. To the people that could potentially even murder others because they feel such strong emotions over things that aren't real. People online were joking and saying things like, oh, if V one day has a girlfriend, people are going to be very upset. And I thought we were past this. I thought a lot of the fandom had kind of aged out of it because there's still a lot of people who have this type of mindset. And I genuinely think this might be the time that you realize the BTS members are human and they're going to have a life of their own. Let me know what you think. Make sure you check out Patreon for more videos. Link down below. Thanks for this lovely comment right here. Love you, bye.